This is just a quick video about my telescope setup. So I've got a Mead ETX here, 125. If I open the lens, you can see that it is F15 in speed and it has a diameter of 127 millimeters. It uses a red dot finder which is up here which we can turn on. You might not be able to see that. There we go, you can just sit there. So this sight is a bit wobbly and it's quite hard sometimes because of the parallax to actually align properly with it. But most of the time it's okay. And most of the time I don't use it because I have this, which is the Auto Star Suite, set up on an old laptop of mine. And that's just connected through a serial COM port. And it's connected to the controller here, the Auto Star controller. And let me just show you a bit of it in action. So if I go ahead here and select something that's in the north hemisphere, if I just say, if I can zoom in here, slew telescope, you can see immediately the telescope is moving toward the object. Just turn the lights in a bit more. Here we go. It's a bit easier to see now. So again, it's really easy just to set it up and select any object in this database and slew the telescope straight to it. It's also quite easy to put a digital SLR camera on here. At the back here, if you unscrew this, this is the eyepiece holder by the way, so you can unscrew this, put your eyepiece in there and look through it and use it as an optical telescope, which is its main purpose. Or you can use a DSLR camera, and you just use a tiering here and a Canon adapter or whatever camera you have, and then you can use a DSLR and then just by selecting or using these knobs to select which uh, way the light's going to go through, you can use your SLR cam DSLR camera. And this is your focusing knob. And that's about it. Thank you for watching.